Constructive criticism presented by destructive people or <laughs> fellows who have not created anything in their lives is just an invalidation in disguise. So in the name of this, well, you know, this is constructive criticism. Yeah, but what I, let's, first of all, let's see what do you, did you construct. Have you constructed something? I don't see your creative or anything. So I don't want to take constructive criticism from someone who has not created one damn thing. It doesn't make sense. But of course, people go robotically thinking or parroting over and over stuff they heard. Like, it's positive criticism, it's positive criticism, it's constructive criticism, it's constructive yeah, But would that wait a moment. When Paco was there presenting the, the album Almoraima, which had electric bass, you know, this melody here. This thing, when he presented that album, the so-called constructive criticism guys, they, 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 they were mad and they, they were really mean with him. So much so he has to go to live outside his country. <laughs> And they said, yeah, it's, it's to know, this is a constructive criticism, you suck. So let me disguise my way to, to, to invalidate you and push you down. And of course, you, to, how can you not accept uh, constructive criticism? Yeah, but you are a destructive fellow, man. <laughs> Destructing is very easy, but, but creating things is not easy. To destroy something, say, if I have to destroy this, I just smashed it, but if I have to, have to make one, then that is very difficult. Or the guitar, so because like destruct, dis, destructing a guitar is easy, but creating one, that's very difficult. So, I don't know, hello, like this doesn't make one them sense. But of course, some, I talk friends and all these things, and they say, oh, wow, this, you know, that's really true. Because in the name of, of, of constructive criticism, we are just taking garbage from others who want to dump this garbage on us. So, the constructive criticism, please. It's a, it's a, so, let me give you some constructive criticism. Translation, let me invalidate you and put, put you down. And please be happy for it and accept it because it's constructive. So, God, this is constructive. You, see? you have to make sense of it. And therefore, these traditionals, they attack Paco like anything. They said, no, why, I, why you put flute, why you are putting electric bass and, and, and lute in the part that he did the thing, you know. He did that with the, with the Arabi lute. With Ud playing. And, and then, of course, the tradition freak out. They said, oh, man, what is this? He's challenging our things. And, so let's give some constructive criticism, translation, put him down, man, otherwise we will look like, like fools or just old-fashioned people, right? So to save face and to defend their, their empty values, the so-called tradition, which by the way, again, many said, well, we have to respect tradition. Translation, please live in the past and ignore any new thing which is better. <laughs> That's what they do. And, and then this constructive criticism. Constructive criticism of what? From a fellow that didn't create anything? No, thank you. Thank you very much. If it will really be constructive, it means it has to come from some constructive guy. Not from someone who, first of all, doesn't know one thing about the topic. Means 
we are equal as human beings, but not that we are equal in every expertise and every field of life. For instance, I don't know quantum mechanics, so how come I am equal to Einstein because I am also a human being and don't respect me because I will give you my opinion about quantum mechanics, even if I don't know one thing about it, but you have to, to acknowledge me because it's me saying, you know, don't hurt my ego, don't offend me, right? You have to be politically correct and just respect others. Right? You respect without knowing what is respecting you, but you need to respect. Of course, respect comes from the root respicere, Greek root, Latin root respicere, which means see as it is, but I don't even need to know that because the root of the of etymological origin of the, of the word tradition comes from, from Latin traditio, and that means also betrayal, like tradition, tradition, same root, and pass on also as well. But it also means betrayal. But I don't need to know that. I actually, you know what, I'm very happy parroting here stuff. I, I want to hear something like Coca Cola is healthy because many people take it. So you're only one playing simply, but everyone plays the other thing. So Coca Cola is very healthy because millions drink it. So it means it's a healthy drink. And it has to make sense, and you respect me for saying, no, wait a moment, I'm a critical thinker. I will analyze on the light of true, your evidence, so-called evidence, and make it into pieces if it is a nonsense, and I don't have to respect that nonsense because we are the same as human beings. We are equal as a human being, and should be respected, anyone should respect all human beings as a human being. That's one thing. But that we are the same knowledgeable or same level of skills, and, and knowledge on fields, different fields of arts, science, etc. That is just a total nonsense. So this constructive criticism is based on what is a parroting thing. These people saying constructive criticism and nobody comes to challenge. Let's see what you construct. Sh show me. That's what I said. Many people in the videos tell me. This concept is wrong or this is wrong. I don't think this is right. In my opinion, this is what well, who is your opinion? Okay, play it, you play it. I am waiting still for the day that someone comes and says, you know this concept is like this. And then play it actually, post a video there uh, as answer. <laughs> right? Part of the answer of the comment is one video there, which is the guy really telling you how is this done, even counting it with the metronome or anything. You are wrong because of this and this is what is wrong. I am still waiting. No one has the why. That is what is all this trolling and bullying about. It's very weak fellows actually, which do not have actually any strength as, as soon as you make them naked by taking away their clothing, which is only based on prejudice, inherited opinions, ignorance, disguises knowledge. Uh, and also this thing of the constructive criticism, parroting business. What constructive criticism? To give constructive criticism is supposed that you know how to construct. This is an evident thing alone. It's just you don't need to be Einstein to know it. And the second is that how you, why you are affected so much, impacted like what others said. How you play? We have this bad ego thing that. Uh, if someone does not acknowledge me, or some people even came to this point, you know what, I want to play a traditional guitar in that party, because if I go there and they see me with, with this or with a weird thing, then they will, of course they will say, well, you know, I give you a, a constructive criticism, you suck. And then they fear it because they don't have strength enough to say, it, it, you will suck actually, because you don't know even what is tradition to begin with. And if you ask any one of these fellows saying tradition is great, we have to respect tradition. Ask them what is tradition, just define that. Or we have to respect others. Okay, tell me, define respect. They don't, they will fall down like anything. The whole building of misconceptions will go to destroy to pieces when they are placing these questions. And then that's why some people love me for what I do, and some other people hate me for the same reason, because I help others play. <laughs> So constructive criticism, this is what you have to first of all know, what is constructing, <laughs> because if someone has not, have not made anything positive, how they will give positive criticism, positive or negative? Some people say that 
yeah, you know, and the, I, I tell them good way, but this your shirt looks like shit, really. Oh, wow, thank you so much. But now you really open my, 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 my eyes, so thank you. Right, so you can see because of the intention and the level of the person saying the nonsense, how is a parroting thing and how is it sometimes by this guy. So you need to become really, really deep and not superficial and think and question, question everything. Even what I'm saying now, just question it, I have no problem. But when we boil down the stuff to the reality, right, then we have a problem in Houston because then we will see how shallow are these so-called followers of tradition thing. This is the same guys who attacked Paco then. And anything which has evol evolved, look at and Nikola Tesla, he invented these pa solar panels, and someone stole this thing, the radio, same thing, was not invented by Marconi, but by Nikola Tesla. Then now, suddenly, all of a sudden, they found the, the real document, which says, oh, in fact, you know what, it was this guy, Tesla, who did it. We are sorry, but this other one, got the pattern, etc. So all these things have it repeated in history. And the so-called positive criticism or constructive criticism given by fellows who have not constructed anything is worth zero. So don't take any of that. Better you be sure you, by your own mind and by your, by your own critical thinking and analysis, what is right, why you follow what you follow, and don't let anyone turn you down with these nonsense terms.